In this tutorial, we'll take a look at how to change font color in InDesign. Let's dig in. I'm in a new document and I've already set some text here using the Type tool. I'm using a block display font called Spot. You can use this font or any font that you prefer. First, let's look at our stroke and fill colors. They're down here in our Tools panel. If they look like this, a solid square and an outline, check out what they do. They change the color of the container holding my text and not the text itself. Instead, we need to take a look at these two icons down here. The first one is for formatting the container itself. The second one is for formatting the text. We need to choose the right one for the job. So let's select the T icon here, and you'll notice our fill color and stroke color look like the letter T now too. Now if I click on the fill color, I can choose a new color that will be applied to the fill of my type. We can choose a color here in this dialog box, or we can use the eyedropper tool down here on the right. Once you've chosen a color, just click OK. It's easy to add a stroke color too. Click on the stroke color here to bring it to the front as the active color. Just click on it and then we can choose a new color again. But let's say we don't want to keep these colors. We can also remove the fill and the stroke colors. Take a look down here. This icon is for applying a color. This icon is for applying a gradient. And this icon here is to apply none. So let's say we want to remove our stroke. I just have to have my stroke color here active for my text and then click Apply None. We can do the opposite too. In fact, we can swap the stroke and fill colors right here. Just click on this dual arrow icon. Now the fill is empty and the stroke has color. We've got one more option here. We can also apply a gradient. It's as simple as clicking Apply Gradient. The default is a black to white gradient. We can open up the gradient tool by double clicking on the Apply Gradient button here. We can use swatches to customize our gradient. Just turn to the swatches panel, which you can find via Window, Color, Swatches. Then I can drag any color here to add it to my gradient. You can also list custom colors here in your swatches. Just click on the plus sign here at the bottom of the swatches panel. Then we can define a new color. Click OK and it's added to your swatches. Swatches can be really handy. For example, I can go back to my fill color from my text and just choose a swatch. And there you have it. Changing the text color in InDesign isn't all that hard once you know where to look. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to our channel. Thanks so much for watching and happy designing.